KSI and Logan Paul are going to fight this weekend and I kind of want to hype it up a little bit. In the beginning, I wanted KSI to win, okay? I wanted him to win most this whole time. Only because Logan Paul needs to get his ass kicked. He's just too cocky sometimes. Sometimes, not all the time, but sometimes. I just feel like he needs a loss in his life. Like he's been winning way too much. He's very athletic and he works very hard. And that is why he wins so much because he works hard at it. He works on his skills and everything that he's in, everything he dabbles himself into. I feel like once you deal with a loss, it'll humble you and it will also give you more of a motivation to keep moving forward and to keep progressing in life. And I honestly believe, and I know some of you may disagree, but I honestly believe that Logan Paul has a good heart. He does, I don't think he's a sociopath. I really don't. But I do want him to lose, so I thought. But because I've been watching Logan Paul train in his videos, and he's working so hard, he's working so hard for this fight. I can't deny that. Like I can't deny his, his, his eager to like just accomplish his goal and that's to win this fight. So I don't know, man. I think I'm gonna go for Logan Paul. I'm gonna have to give it to him. Comment below, let me know who you think should win. All right, so let's go ahead and watch this video and see what these fans have to say. Looking quick, he's looking quick. Oh, oh. Well, yeah, well. Let's go, JJ! All right, boys and girls, here we are on Venice Beach for the public workout of KSI versus Logan. Now, we are gonna be interviewing some of the public and sort of getting an idea of what these American fans think is gonna happen, all right? The first fight happened in the UK, and now the rematch is gonna, and that ended up in a tie. And now the rematch is gonna happen here in the US. I, I like KSI because Wait, if him and I had babies, we'd have mixed babies. Hey, let's not Ooh. Win. With, with Logan and I, we'd just have mixed feelings. <laughs> right. I like that. Good. I like that. Did you ever get some chicken nandos with me? Maybe. Yeah, come on. Yeah, I don't know. Ooh, very good. Right, we're gonna go now. Bloody weirdos. Right. Yeah, bye. See you. Get me out of here now. <laughs> what is your name? Georgia. Georgia. Who do you think is gonna win out of KSI and Logan Paul? I know KSI is gonna win. Why? Because he's better. He's a better boxer. So. By the way, the majority of the people believe that KSI is gonna win, or that they want him to win. Whew. You know, KSI wins the fight. He points into the crowd. Georgia. <laughs> Come up to the ring, Georgia. Give me a kiss. What do you do? I'll do it. There you go, JJ. Who do you think is gonna win? Definitely KSI. Yeah, I think KSI was well, I think KSI. It's Logan for sure. Why KSI? Because didn't he beat you up? Yeah, he absolutely he beat me. Yeah, he pummeled me. Yeah, Joe Weller, that guy right there, he fought, he fought, he fought KSI. After that fight, KSI won, and he went on the mic to, um, to challenge Logan Paul. So that's how they ended up fighting. <laughs> Wait, any of you going to the fight? Uh, where even is it? Where even is it? Oh, God. Staples Center. <laughs> yeah, mate, let's do it. Hello, saying. young boys. All right, so what do you think is going to happen? KSI versus Logan. KSI. Yeah? No confidence in, the, in, the, in his energy. In his energy? Yeah. There you go. KSI 100% going to win, according to Stavros. Wait, what's your name? Yaleen. 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 Great bloke. Love him. All right, nice one, mate. Cheers. Cheers. If you watched the first fight, Logan Paul had a really nice jab. He actually he boxed did. pretty well, and he, he did. did really well early, and then he just completely gassed. If he can get his wind up, I think it's easier to get your wind up rather than get your boxing skills in a short amount of time. For sure. So I would For say sure. Logan Paul's the favorite in this fight. That's, that's 100%. Me, the voice of boxing, David Diamante. Right, who? But we don't know if KSI worked on his skill and his ability neither. So we already know that KSI has got the lungs for it, okay? He had no problem fighting in that ring. He just needed to work on the skills of the, of the boxing. Should we get Rodney, Ricky, Bilbo? Who do you think is going to win this fight? Uh, KSI for sure. Absolutely. He just looks like a fighter. Like, I wouldn't want to fight him. If you had to go on a date with one of the boys, who would it be? <laughs> what about you? Am I allowed to choose you? Choose me? 
I mean, it, if you want to, I guess. Alright, hit me up after the fight. Okay, deal. What is your name? Noah. She gets lots and lots of guys, okay? <laughs> and she's confident. That girl was confident right there. She can get any man she wants to talking like that. Noah, do you know her? Who's gonna win this fight? I say Logan Paul, third round knockout. Really? Yeah. Why is that? I just think he's the better boxer. He looks better. KSI versus Logan Paul. It has to be KSI, but I think both of them are underestimating the opponent. I agree. Well. They both think it's, it's going to be easy. I don't think it's going to be easy. I don't think so does either. Remember the storm. Yeah. I think late on he will know how to finish it this time. Yeah. You know, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. Facts. I think both of them will have both leveled up tremendously. Like, yeah. so either way, we're in for a big fight. Yeah. But all I'm going to say, right? So you're Logan Paul. I'm KSI. Quickly put your jab on my head. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Do you know what I'm saying? That's true. Like, it's and. With the lighter gloves, I just feel like it's going to be hard for JJ to, you know, get past it early on. Do you know any, like, secrets in the J, like, KSI camp? Like, because obviously you've been to his house and stuff. Do yeah. you know anything? Well, I, I, I'm not going to lie to you. I was only there for like a couple of hours, so I didn't actually pick up much. Uh, so, yeah, I don't, I don't know much. All right, respect. <laughs> what Nico, well up. Over and out. Big up, big up. <laughs> Legitimate. <laughs> Legitimate. You want to have a go? Come on, Sam. Oh, I'm very well. How are you? Been. Really? That's brilliant. That's it. So, what is your name? Mojo. Mojo? Yeah. That is a class name. <laughs> so, who is going to win this scrap? KSI or Pogan Law? Um, <laughs> Pogan. I think KSI's got it in the bag just because his intense training camp and, you know, he's been training for a long time. Someone is getting knocked out, but I hope it's KSI, but... You hope KSI's getting knocked out? No, I hope KSI wins, oh, but... Okay. You know, best man wins. Yeah, that's the thing. Best man wins. That's all we want. For sure. I respect, mate. I got respect for the both of them. Nice one, mate. All right, so we're here with James. <laughs> James, right. Everyone always calls me that, man. Really? But James Rodriguez. Yeah. Anyways, Logan Paul, KSI, who's going to win? Logan Paul, baby. I'm telling you, second, third round is over. Why is that, matey? You see how big this dude is? Yeah, but mate, being big, what <laughs> size does do? Size is nothing. I'm here for Logan, and I'm from Ohio too, so I know how us Ohio guys got it, you know? Respect, <laughs> Hammers. So, after getting the wise words uh -oh. of the public, I think... I did hear about that. I heard that KSI and Logan Paul were training outside at Venice Beach, California. And I've actually been there, um, what was it, like two years ago. We did a family trip over there at Venice. And man, it's nice out there. I love it. Chance to speak to the fighters. But this is the thing, like, you talk about obviously getting hit. The first opponent. And, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you talk about obviously, you know, getting hit and not being worried about that. Yes. But, you know, there was a reason why you probably were tentative last time. And that's because yes. feeling the stiff jam, you know, it, it is a shock. So with, with 10 ounce gloves and no head guard, do you think... That will have any effect, you know, no, I didn't. feeling that. So, like, his shots never dazed me, never, like, finished me at any point. I wasn't, like, That's true. rocked. Like, That's I true. I was rocked. I wasn't, like, even That's when, true. I think it was the fifth round where he had the flurry of punches. Yeah, yeah. I just got it, and I was calm, and then I came back straight after, so. That's true. It did not phase him. He got hit pretty hard, too. Logan Paul got him pretty good, but it did not phase him. He just did the little whiplash, and then he went back. Let's go. Logan Paul, he was just gas. Like that boy did not have his lungs in place and together, nothing. So he just pretty much was over. But I don't know, man. It's gonna be crazy. It's gonna be a crazy fight. Like his jab isn't a problem. It's just I was afraid of getting hit. It was just the mental barrier that just I was always there, like hit and not get hit, hit and not get hit. That's why my fight against you. Yeah. I was just pumping the jab because yeah, yeah. I didn't want you to get anywhere yeah. near me. Because I mean that was the thing for me, like the second you started like hitting me with those jabs, yeah. it just stunned me and I couldn't I couldn't get my rhythm. I yeah. like yeah. everything just went out of my head. It, it, like it's taken me almost two years to get over that barrier. So yeah. it's it's one of those things where I know Logan hasn't got over that and once I get stuck in, yeah. he's gonna have a real problem and he's gonna panic. And that panic is gonna be a lot he's gonna use up a lot of energy. While he's panicking, yeah. and then I can just utilize that and finish him off. Yeah. The interesting thing is going to be, obviously, if one of you do get sent to the canvas, yeah. you know, are you, you know, have you, have you experienced getting put down in, and coming back from that? If I'm being honest, I haven't. But that's because I'm just, uh, I'm just a brute, bro. <laughs> if I'm being honest, like I sparred with pros, and you know, I had, I had six rounds where I got beat the 
The F-O. <laughs> it's got, very good. Yeah, yeah, live on, yeah. live on, live on the sky I, I, screen. Well done. I got finished. Absolutely finished. But I mean, like, I still stood tall. Like, I still was there taking the damage. He hit me with big body shots. Hit me with big, you know, shots to the shots to the head. And I was, like, I was tired during the spa, but, like, I still kept going. And, you know, I just took the damage. So it was... It was all, yeah, like, I don't know, I just can take damage. Woo, this place is going to be crazy. There you are, I'm excited Hair to watch it. Logan Paul, let's wrap this up. Yeah. I think I'm going to become a YouTuber. You should get involved, get involved, voice for me. Undercard. Is that what you need, mate? So, after our first conversation since our fight, right, watching JJ train, he looked class, right? By that, I mean, you know, he was classy. He was in the zone. He wasn't trying to like play up to the camera and be a, you know, be an idiot. He was there to do a job and he looked powerful, right? He looked slick. He looked crafty. And I enjoyed it. Overall, he just seemed in the right place, you know. His answers were straight and to the point. And yeah, he, I think he is how? fully ready. Hey, it's giving you? First of all, how, could, how can they do that? How can they train when a lot of people are just staring at you? It's so uncomfortable when I go to the gym, if I just see one pair of eyes looking at me and they're not really looking at me, they're in their headphones, they're in their zone, but I just feel so uncomfortable. I don't know how the hell they're working out in front of those people. I don't think Gibbs is here. Yeah, Gibbs, Gibbs, uh -oh. Gibbs, 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 Gibbs is stepping stone for me to fight. I got a question for Joe. Why did you let Jake knock you, knock you down? Oh, mate. Honestly, I thought I was going to go there, beat him up in his own backyard and make my comeback. You know, the story was there and mate, like it couldn't have gone worse. Like, it is what it is. I thought, dare to try, why not? I, I, lo I love Joe Weller. I've been a Joe Weller fan for like years now. <laughs> I remember when Logan slid in my DMs. He was like, yo, bro, can I can I copy your WWE video? And I was like, yo, go for it, bro, go for it. Dude, he was, he's hilarious, and I still think he's one of the best on the platform to this day. I'm a Joe fan. I want Joe, I want Joe commentating this event. Is that happening? I don't even know who Joe Weller is. I mean, I know of him. That's this guy. That's his channel. That's the video that we're watching. But this is my first time actually watching a video of his. I wonder if he's entertaining or not. I'll probably look into him some more. He is. He is with us here. Amazing. Amazing. Joe and Gip. Oh, I didn't act that one of them. Look at, look at uh, Jake. He didn't understand the joke or he was lost and confused. Look at him. He is with us here. Look at him. Amazing. Amazing. Look at Jake. Joe and Gip. <laughs> <laughs> he looks so confused. Yes. Oh, I didn't act out one of them. <laughs> I'm sorry, Joe. I love you too. I love you too. I love you. Classy, Jake, mugging me off. Obviously, some of you thinking that maybe I should try and fight him at this point, but look, I can handle banter. Now, uh, looking at Logan, obviously, he seemed composed, but he also had a lot of nervous energy. Like, you could see it coming out of him. He was wanting to show the crowd, like, look, I am a fighter. And we also saw his team, like, proper start on uh, KSI and his team. So, more mind games, I think, like, more than anything. But, but yeah, he looked good, powerful. Uh, we didn't actually see him do pads and show as much as JJ did. Don't know why. Is there a reason? I don't know. But, Maybe. yeah, I wasn't... He doesn't want to show his moves. He doesn't know what he's got planned. Still with how he conducted himself and seemed in the zone. They both seem very, very ready for this. And it's great to see boys and girls. Anyways, I have been Sniper Wagon Weller, right, Joseph. And I'm commentating on the fight, so make sure you listen and enjoy. Uh, it's going to be great. But for now, please leave a like right in because this is amazing, right, this whole event. I love it. Uh, and yeah, I'll see you soon. Peace. Ooh -wee. What are these, by the way? Pliers, I'll take one. Pliers. There you have it. All right, girls. Thank you very much. Pamela, Ruby, over and out. I am so excited to watch the fight. I don't know who's going to win. Honestly, they're both training really hard for this event. Oh, it's going to be tough. If KSI wins, he deserves it. If Logan Paul wins, he deserves it. But I am going to pick a person and I'm going to go with Logan Paul. I was all about KSI until like two weeks ago. Oh my gosh, it's gonna be a good fight. Make sure you guys watch that. All right, you guys, thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. And please turn on your notifications so you can get notified every time I upload. Thank you for watching. I will see you in the next video. Peace.